Hello everybody, welcome to Concorso Ferrari here at Pebble Beach. Really impressive display of 70 cars here at Pebble Beach on the first green. And we have lots of eye candy to share with everybody. My name is Richard Michael Owen, and I am super excited to share with you the Ferraris that are here. I'm joined by Sam. Hey. And yeah, we're gonna just go through the cars. Let's start with this, which is my favorite over here. We have a 59 uh, 250 Testarossa Fantuzzi Spider, chassis number 0766. This car, in its first appearance, won Sebring 12 hours. And uh, also, same year, won the Le Mans Test. Uh, it's as good as it can be. <laughs> yeah, it's in its 1959 World Championship configuration. Pretty amazing piece of works competition tester. Also, there's only a handful of these in the world. Look inside here. See the aluminum's all painted hammer tone. Got that plexi scoop. And if we go to the middle here, you can notice something. And then if we go right dead on here, we can actually see the motor isn't in the center. It's off to the passenger side and actually kicked over. And that's so that the driver can sit lower and the drive shaft is next to the driver. Pretty interesting. That's only a feature you see on the works Testarossas. Now, speaking of Testarossas, we have basically the first pontoon bodied Ferrari. And this is the body that got put on all of the later customer cars. So it has the scallops behind the front wheels. It's called the 250 Monza. And basically yeah. it's the Testarossa prototype. They call it Monza prototype too. This is chassis number 0432. And uh, well, if you remember two years ago, they were auctioning this off at Meekham. Uh, they did up to 21 million and did not meet the reserve. Yeah, I think Dana Meekham still owns this car That's true. as the highlight of his collection. It's a Scaglietti designed car fully. That's why the tag's on here. Only cars that Scaglietti design have this tag. See that down there? It's the interior is fairly simple. Got some staggered seats, beautiful wood rim steering wheel. Amazing car. It's unique treatment in the rear too, the way the taillights are incorporated. Yeah, yeah very fabulous V12 competition Ferraris here at Pebble Beach. We got a 250 Elena, I believe. Beautiful color. A 166 up here, Touring Berlinetta. This is the configuration for Le Mans. Really beautiful Touring shapes. It's the same as the Barchetta, just with a roof over top. Really nice Ferrari here at Pebble yeah, Beach. Very early car. And there you go. Yeah, we have a heavy hitter here. Oh, uh, yeah. Ferrari 250 GTO in front of Casa Ferrari. Pretty amazing sight. Of course, the 64 body style. Sorry, I don't know all these 250 GTOs by chassis number. So just admire the lines today. Look at that. What an amazing lineup of Ferraris here. Whoa. We have a little jewel behind the 250 GTO. I believe it's a 212 Export. So what's unique about this is it's a competition chassis Ferrari with a jewel-like road going body by Vignale. See the most unusual grill treatment here with the Ferrari badge. Check that out. Okay, here we go. I really like this car. I think it's chassis 0425 GT. It's a comp chassis with an aluminum body. Special body by Pininfarina. Uh, 
Kind of done in the style of the Tour de France competition car. Cars. Okay, here we go. The start of the 250 GT series. This car kind of became known as the Tour de France. Here we are in French livery. Amazing car, wrap around rear windscreen like a, the early cars. So from this body style, they went to the Tour de France that looks like this. Amazing, amazing car. Beautiful lines. Love the paint scheme. Big 340 America cabin behind it. We have so many cars, like even with I have nine cars. No, it says America with the body lines. <laughs> it's a big cabriolet. There's no doubt about it. In a vibrant blue. We can have a look at the interior. Wow, look at that. I love painted dashboards. Wow, magnificent. Where to next? Got 250 cab there. Looks like a 212 Inter. Another 250 cab. Long wheelbase California Spider. 250 LM in behind that. The Swiss Shudaria Philip and Nettie livery. Okay, now here's where we get into modern cars here at Casa Ferrari. There are 30 to 35 Ferrari Monza SP1 and SP2. Look at that. They're everywhere. All sorts of liveries from Ferrari's past and new liveries. These things. Yesterday the middle was empty. Oh yeah, they have put something over there. That's an S. The two. No, it's the new small one. Is that? Yeah. The 296 for Yeah. Oh, yeah. So the centerpiece of all these Monzas is Ferrari's new baby supercar. It's the Ferrari 296 GTB. Look at that. What a beautiful design. What do you think? 800 horsepower, 200 miles an hour, 3 liter V6 turbocharged. Pretty incredible. Okay, I've got to check this out. I want to see under the hood of one of these SPs, see what it's packing. Wow, look at that. Just barely see the front of the engine well behind the front wheels. Very cool. Very well made. All carbon fiber. Big clamshell. Amazing. Look at the sight here. Look at that. Which way? Well, actually, there are some other... Oh, I like this Monza. In high curves green, I know this car comes from Vancouver. The yellow accents, really neat spec. Really stands out. Yeah, that's an SP2. Okay, we got a few more classics back here. So some, some more stuff still to check out. I see a Sergio over here. See the Sergio over there? Okay, Tony, on your left. Yeah, some nice classics here. Sergio, the last pinning Farina bodied Ferrari. I think there's only seven or eight of them in the world. I've never seen the one in silver here. Let's have a look at it. It's a cream interior. That's cool. Silver on cream, not your typical color combos. I've never seen this either. Wow. Very beautiful, elegant lines. We're really getting into Ferrari supercars here now. F40, F50. Yeah, 
We got Enzo in back there. Yeah, wow. Amazing stuff here at Concorso Ferrari for Pebble Beach. We got, okay, yeah. I'll finish up on this 275 that I know a little bit about. 275 happens to really have a warm spot in my heart. And this one is the 1967 Paris Motor Show car, outside yeah. filler, really special car. Look at the lines on that. It's like a production 250 GTO. It is. <laughs> All right, well, I'm nearly out of breath. So I'm gonna call it. That's our coverage of your Concorso Ferrari here at Pebble Beach. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you later. Bye-bye. Ciao.